looking for a new audio. A new audio. A new audio. All the water for the pasta. Put some salt. Oh. And oil. Here and we're waiting for the pasta to cook. We need garlic. Cherry tomato, spring onion, and some prawn. Okay. First, we need to smash this garlic so that it's easier to peel. Okay, then we need to chop. You just roughly chop. If you have a chopper, then it's easier. I don't have, so I need to chop it by hand. So that's a little bit chunky. It's good for one because I'm alone. We can twist here. Come on, come on, come on. Get in. Go in. Okay. And we will wait for ten minutes. Until this one is all dainty. Okay, just leave it there. And then we need this. This time you need to use an olive oil. I'm using natural olive oil, extra virgin olive oil. So let me show you how much this is that much. Okay. And then now we will put the garlic. So we will fry the garlic. You just only wait until golden brown. Can you see or not? Yeah. My first time is here. Twist. And 
bottom, you can see like this. Okay. So you need to remove from the pan as soon as possible. Because we don't want those of garlic to be burned. Okay, that is maybe set aside. So like this, that connects. Point, point. Okay, then set aside. I don't know where I put, but I need to set aside. Okay, then just leave it here. So we're done with the fried garlic. We can chop already our cherry tomato. Okay, we just only need some. Mm, I think that should be enough, I guess. And cut into half. Like this. Cherry. Okay. okay. This prawn shrimp. Okay. I need to cut into half, or you can cut into half like half like this. Okay, it's up to you which one is you prefer. Cut in the middle. So this recipe, recipe is good for one, so I can cut this one also. Okay. And then some we need also. And then we need to sit aside again. This one there. Hold on. What my mess. And what else? This one, spring onion. Uh, we need only the green colors, so we can cut here. We can save this one for another recipe. And we need this. Chop. And then set aside. Now we will check again our pasta. It should be okay. And then that's it. It's cooked. We need to sit here and we will drain. Okay. Then we need another wok. One. And then now we can use the this one. We can use the oil from here. Okay, because we have an extra, we can put some like that. If it's already hot, you can put this cherry tomato and stir. Wait for this cherry tomato to become half cooked. Tomato is already almost half cooked. 
your own plate. I might be using my own plate because I'm alone. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Set aside. And you can see like this. See? Yummy! of the spring onion to garnish. Do if you need less then make it less but I I love that spring onion. So I'm using this one then I can put on the top the rest of the garlic. So this is my aglio olio, aglio olio, okay. Mm -mm. Isn't it good? Looks nice, look delicious. Good for the party. It's healthy, it's cheap, but it's so healthy. Because we have the tomato and the garlic in there. So aglio olio is translates to spaghetti with garlic and oil. That's a traditional uh, dish contains little more than this ingredients. Mm -hmm. 